for a second. Good job. I was going to put it in the description, but the button, I touched the button instead. That, that works fine. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the Cartographer's Guild. My name is Josh. I'm Drea. I'm Leah. I'm Brad. And we're on a desert planet full of Krogan. I, I'm not full of Krogan. What? <laughs> so we're talking to Krogan, because Krogan are the best. All right, let's see her. Do, do, Why do. does everybody not like her? There must be some reason. <laughs> Good question. Uh, uh, let's hear. Do you guys have anything to talk about? Terminal. Ah, Varen Jerky updated. I've gotten some questions, and I want to make it clear that yes, this is genuine Varen Jerky, not textured proteins covered in salt so that you can't tell the difference. Not some garbage I came up with that kind of tastes the same. This is prime cut Varen, slow roasted, Klexen style, and then marinated in pie jack sauce. It's ready to kick down the door to your mouth and charge in shotgun first to assault your taste buds. We've got a full crate, and best offer takes them. Wanted cleaning service. My custom microfabricator is great, but it's stubborn. But it's a stubborn beast, and every time I run a repair, I end up splitting, uh, spitting extra pieces all over my workroom. You wouldn't think that would be a problem, but the bricks that fit together are tough little Vorcha pellets, and they're sharp too. I've had the worst pain of my life stepping on the damn things. Need somebody to come in and sweep the workroom so I can walk around without punching holes in my feet. Offering microfabricator repair work on firearms or other small appliances in return. See, Legos. Yeah, Legos. Yeah, Legos. My turn. <laughs> of course it's cloned, you whiny bunch of Vorcha. I said it wasn't textured proteins. I never said it was original meat. It's built from a template of preserved tissue, though. You can ask a scientist. It's real marin meat, even if it never hung on a bone itself. Now quit whining and make an offer. <laughs> Don't go work for Sloan. Wait, she's dead. And the worm. Oop. Hello, everyone. Let's hear you. Oh, you're a thing. Yes, she's you up there. were a thing. There we go. You Ravener Brank? Struck sent me. He said hey. that you... Yes. I'll be later in the fight. Hey, Nexus. I'm the one you talked to. I'm Nakmar Morna, overlord of the Krogan in Helios. Overlord? Drak, Kesh said you had a new job. She didn't tell me you did. And you're the celebrated pathfinder from the Hyperion found at last. I'm right. This is thrilling. I've never stood so close to a pathfinder before. Mostly because the Krogan never got one. Welcome to New Tachanka. Neither of these are good options. Well, I'm, I'm leaning towards you're angry, I get it. Okay. Sure. I understand you and your people are pissed off. Humans were welcomed into the Citadel Council with open arms, while the Krogan endured centuries of oppression. You have no idea. Your understanding only makes me mad. I mean, she wasn't a like we said okay. no matter what. Gotcha. Loud and clear. Why are you here, Pathfinder? See what a successful colony looks like. Actually, yes. Our outposts are new. We could use the advice. Your manipulation is so transparent. No advice for you. Only regret. Watch. The Krogan will thrive and the initiative will pay. Get out of my face before I smash it. You want to step in here, Drac? Or... I like it's been a treat. Yeah. <laughs> going to journal about this later. See you soon. <laughs> this is so going to my dream journal. I mean, that was funny, but it was a really weak comeback. Not good. Yeah, maybe. She said we'd pay. I'm not gonna lie. I'm worried. Let's talk to Brent before we freak out. Hmm. Another terminal. Oh no, these are updated ones. We won't find the originals. Damn it.
What's going on? Some other kind of peach. <laughs> okay. Half the time, I feel like I'm the only one on it's all peach. You probably are. Side by side, we're always in competition, making stronger. Now they have no enemies to fight, so they're fighting each other. I can see the tension building, colonists taking sides. This is how clan wars start. I mean, so give them an enemy seems like the. But well, I don't maybe. know what it would be. Let's see. Sure. Sounds like all they need is something to shoot. That's exactly what they need. Best way to stop this feud is to perform a rite of union. Which is? Shove them into a ring with a beast. Make them fight as a team. Defeating a common foe creates a powerful bond. Groban, don't take that lightly. Help me perform the rite, but we can hold this colony together. How am I supposed to help with the rite? I hope you don't mean me. <laughs> no, but I do need you to help me drive the beast into the arena. Shadows make a special lure for this. Should help some do it. That seems dumb. Uh, uh let's ask. All right. Do you really think Varka and Grant could cause a war? Big problems to start out small. Not taking any chances. Well, of okay, course sure. we'll do it. I'll do whatever I can to help. Good. Set this lure out in the wild to attract the feed. Beast might be feisty at first, so stay on your toes. I'll keep Barker and Brent from getting his crows till we get back. Good luck. <coughs> Yay! Alright. Talk to everybody. I don't sell Rinkle the humans. Matter of principle. <laughs> I assume that's booze. It yeah. Like it's Krogan booze. Probably the only in the galaxy. Not really. I'm the only distiller in the galaxy. Ha! Ah. <laughs> what made you pick up and come to Helios? I was sick of living on a dead planet, watching my people tear each other apart. And they can tear each other right here. On the next <laughs> is a chance to start over. But you left the Nexus. And built this. Best decision the Krogan ever made. Just wish it was on better terms. Not wise to burn bridges out here. What was it like, traveling on the Nexus? Don't know. I remember Solarians packing us into cryo. Some of us needed a double hit to hold sleep. <laughs> then, nothing. Suddenly, we were here. You want to know more, ask Barrett. He says he woke up mid-journey and lived 50 years alone on the Nexus. Yikes! He has to be lying. Probably. Good story. <laughs> what do you have against selling drink calls? It'll kill ya. Probably. Too much time, baby. The fact is, you can't. Maybe it won't kill you, but it'll leave me a mess to clean up. Bet I can handle it. No. Ryder. Don't be an idiot. That's all for now. Back to it. More so than usual. Yeah. Like, Shepard might be able to handle it. You don't stand to chance. And it's an Erd knot. <laughs> it is. That's a clan, right? Yeah. That's what Rex That was Rex's was clan. Great. Neither of them sound good, mm. but it's rustic. That's what we're going for. Rustic. <laughs> <laughs> All right. There's a lot of free fat materials here and shuttles. Some of it was gear we had stored away on the Nexus. <laughs> How long has the colony been here? You're not going to give us an actual number, are you? No. Probably true. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they have the dumped tails, right?
That means Drax, or uh, not Drax, but this guy's old as hell, too. Yeah. yeah. I'll talk to you later. So, their home, Tuchanka is their home planet, mm -hmm. and the radiation is from them bombing each other to the Stone Age? Yes. Yeah. yeah. The, they discovered nuclear weapons independently before they were uplifted by the Solarians. Yeah. Uh, and, yeah, they... Blew themselves up. They blew themselves up. Yeah. Yeah. They're our cautionary tale. Yeah, pretty much. That was also a sign that maybe they shouldn't have been uplifted, but the Solarians were desperate. Uh, Thanks! Kiss my ass! <laughs> well, that went well. Now we still have to find the guy we actually came here to talk to. Yep. Oh, you alright there, buddy? I'm down here. I'm different from the pictures I saw. Uh, I'm down here. <laughs> uh, that was my father. You probably saw pictures of my dad. Your dad? You replaced him as Pathfinder? It's a long story. Haven't really kept up with Nexus news. Enough trouble to occupy me here. Scavengers? Amongst other things. You seen the flop house yet? That's where they get together. 80% shacks, 100% trouble. I'll give you the nav point so you can avoid it. Or not, as you choose. Have you had much trouble with the scavengers of the colony? Not yet. They're not that stupid. A bunch of squishies against a hundred-odd Krogan? Give it a little time. Resources run low, they'll get desperate. Who knows? Tell me more about the flop house. It's a loose collection of shelters where some scavenger gangs gather. They knock each other around, drink, and then when they're all riled up, on raids. And if you get close when they're hungry, well, that's how I lost a liver and gained a limp. Yeah. yeah. Thanks. This information will come in handy. Excuse me. Just trying to help. Be careful out there, Pathfinder. See, a lot of people here seem nicer than Morta. Well, yeah. Which is probably why there's so many of them thinking Morta's gonna ruin this place. I mean, some of them are calling us Nexus trash, and, you know... I mean, that I'm was Morta. <laughs> oh, I thought we walked by some people that were doing no, it. No, that was Morta. Oh, okay. Let's see here. Where are... I mean, you'll probably find Morta loyalists, but... Uh, what's in the... Yay! Notice, building regulations. Hey everyone, as we continue building new structures, remember the building is like firing your shotgun into a pack of Varen. Adjust your safety first. We don't want to lose fo uh, we don't want to focus on the con, so let's have a proversation about safety. Wow. <laughs> Please wear helmets while building unless you really don't want to. Don't use the welding torches for tattoos unless you're sure it's something you want on your skin forever. Quit stealing supp supplies. We've got computers, we know you're doing it, and we'll shoot you. Only add guns to things the plans say they that should have guns on them. Don't fire your guns into the air in celebration unless you shout that you're going to do so beforehand. Thank you. <laughs> Notice, turret upgrades. Warlord Morta told me to upgrade the turrets before I left for Apex training, so I'm going to be pouring a little fire on them to make sure you're not crying like a volus with a busted suit as soon as I leave. Keep your IFFs up to date. I'm going to be firing off test rounds, and I don't want my little gun friends to mistake you for a cat. Also taking, uh, also taking requests. Anybody want cryo ammo in these? Maybe incendiary? Let me know if you want to, to shatter your enemies or just laugh while they roll around trying to put themselves out. Also, also, any kills the turret gets count as mine for the colony standards. <laughs> and finally, oh, this is Leah. You're gonna love this. Crant the raging. Should I read it? Go ahead. Imagine that you're a proud warrior fighting for your people at the height of the Rachni War when the ancient spirits of Tuchanka awaken and spread across the galaxy. Some are changed, gaining magical powers and a tie to the homeworld through the blood of Kalros herself, while others become horrible monsters. Can you conquer the beast within and save the galaxy? Join us in Krantz the Regioning, a live-action role-playing experience for Krogan who want to combine collaborative storytelling with light, non-lethal combat. All you need is 
any dice roller app, the light show Omnitool utility, dummy ammo for any gun you bring, and your own imagination. Meet friends and have fun in a supportive environment. Contact poster for information on meetup times. Yes, somewhere around here there is a gaming geek amongst the Crokin. Well, now I have to go all the way back downstairs to read the update. Yep. That is some body ass jokes. <laughs> oh, no, right? Uh, I could track her down for you. Make sure she's okay. I would like that. If you find her, will you give her the cryo bracelet? Tell her she can use it to visit me again. Thank you, Pathfinder. <laughs> Yeah, you seem sweet. My father called me a Salarian in a broken body. It's supposed to be an insult. Joke's on him, though. I like Salarians. <laughs> what are you doing up here? Look, back home we didn't have time to just stop him. Is life that different here? It's all about survival. Here we don't have to fight so hard. Of course, the older ones still think they have to fight. Maybe it's just in their blood. Now, he must have done something, because his armor is ornamented, and I'm pretty sure you have to gain those. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure he did fight, he yeah. just didn't necessarily love it. Sounds like Helios was an easy choice for you. New galaxy, new life. I'm not interested in being birthed like my father, or battling it out on the Joker. I almost didn't want to be back to the cry over the journey. Wanted to see the whole thing. Would have been pretty Worm. Never be by we have Worm home. Sign! Hmm. Speaking of Wormsign, did you guys hear that they're uh, releasing a new Dune RPG uh, in anticipation of the uh, upcoming uh, movie? I did not hear that. Yep. Mm -hmm. uh, I can't. I tried to talk to you. You didn't have a thing. What? Maybe you were talking to me. No, it said quarter. A wise approach. Business won't get far if he only sells to Krogan. He's more concerned with proving the point in Krogan's cartel than the thing he has made. Now buy some before he starts yelling again. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing with a venom? Hello. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. You want to talk to me? Find the. Krogan's friend. I'm with the Andromeda initiative. That's worse. Worse it is. You want to buy? Talk to myself. I hired him so I don't have to deal with the customers. <laughs> well, you're just a bundle of laughs. Max is a paradise and there's this. You don't want to go back? Even a little? Way to be insulting, Ryder.
Wow, so he was alive when it happened. I was like imagine he was up for like five minutes before everyone else started waking up. Yeah. Just decided to make a story out of it. Hi, sweetheart. Good night. Hi. Flappers, did you take your oh, stuff? Oh, whoop, whoop, whoop. Okay. Did you take your stuff? Yes. Okay. Night. Night. Nice recovery, Josh. Yeah, I thought for sure I was gone. <laughs> and then we died. It was the worst day ever. Okay. So let's see if we can find that terminal again so we can continue. Yeah, it was all the way in the basement. Yeah. Well, actually, it wasn't. It was just like down here. There's actually a further level down. Oh, is there? Yep. Boop. All right, there you uh, go. Oh, uh, thanks to all who came out to our recent event. Special thanks to the Pijacks who thought they would show up with real ammo and scare the weaklings playing games. It's really interesting to see how a group of social activity like Cramp the Regioning attracts people who want to ruin others' fun, and also to see how a group used to working with other people can come together as a team and stomp on some faces. Also, all of you who were part of the Dreams of the Lost Thresher event, you made me cry. Remember to sync your dice roller apps and see you soon! <laughs> I don't... Did we find the social interaction one? I don't think No, we, we didn't. Uh, we'll uh, have to find that somewhere. Oh, well. Damn it all. Okay, where is the basement basement? I think it was over here. Basement basement. More just sounds like a real problem. Yes, we're going to have to deal with that. Alright, you don't have a thing. Okay. All croaky females are voiced by the same person. We oh, hey, what you got? Hey, Nexus, back me up. The initiative did cure the general things like they promised, right? Not a cure, but they've made some good progress. Barely. There's no point in getting our hopes up. It's our duty to populate the colony with strong enough for offspring. Have you tried having kids before? Of course. Before the journey and after and often. We just need to keep trying. Doesn't hurt to try? It's easy for you to say. Your children don't die in the race. Ugh. Wait, is she trying to tell him she doesn't want to do it anymore? Yeah, she's, yeah. she's she has run out of hope. She doesn't believe that it'll work and doesn't and it's obviously her to fail. So. That would be horrible. Yeah, this is a tough one. I'm inclined to say that when she's ready to put on the brakes, put on the brakes, but mm -hmm. I'm a woman. No, I, I think no you sense. have every right to say that. All right. And uh, Silver agreed with us. Where are you? That kind of thing oh, is like one. submarine keys. Both people have to turn for it to go. No, I'm not going to do right this right now. now. If this? I remember correctly, it's They're useless. It's fighting. Okay. Okay. I 
I'd like to see it. Next time we go out looking for fiends, we'll take it. Bring it. Bring, Bring it. it, assholes. Fiends? Yeah, they're tough. How about we find an architect and throw that in the mix? Now we're talking. Might kill us. Uh, that sounds fun. You're okay, Nexus. <laughs> Damn, Skippy. You're right. those dipshits that just sit around talking about all the fights you're going to get into but never actually go anywhere, aren't you? Probably. Not a fault. We were programmed to walk. Ugh. There we go. Da, 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 da. Hey! Oh, hey, Brink. Hey, it's Plot. There you are. We've talked to, like, six other people. How about tell me what you know? Let's not... Not beat around the bush here. Yeah, that, that was annoying. Hard to miss. What's on this terminal? Ah, here we go. Social interactions. All right, everyone. Most of you are used to either gender-segregated camps back in Tachanka or mostly male mercenary work off-world. But now we're all together, and it's time for us to make the most of this problatunity. <laughs> With females sending breeding requests and males asking many questions about fertility, we've had some good dialogue so far, and in most cases, everyone has already recovered from their injuries. To that end, we've added some mandatory cultural education. Blasto 6, Partners in Crime. <laughs> Notice Blasto and Blasto's partner's sister agreeing to engage in mating rituals. Blasto's partner does not attempt to assert authority over his sister or shoot Blasto for mating with his sister without permission. <laughs> Fleet and Flotilla. Uh, Bellicus and Chalet are good models of behavior. Uh, for behavior of a couple that is interested in courting despite cultural differences. Do not sing, though. Nobody sings while mating. That's just the thing they do in vids sometimes. I cannot stress that enough. <laughs> Krant hardly wait. Now I know some of you got offended by having a young Krogan court a human female, but since this vid is literally about a Krogan male trying to learn appropriate courtship behavior, you are all going to shut up and watch it. Also, Vega Bull Jr. does a great job as the human female's father, and he should be made an honorary Krogan. <laughs> Asari Confessions 26, True Blue. Couldn't hurt. After that, we recommend that you try some edutainment <laughs> in the form of one of the dating sims available at any kiosk. Um, I cannot think of, or I can think of a few better ways for us to learn about romance than by playing an interactive game on the subject. <laughs> sure, that will give you perfect information. <laughs> I, I told wow. you these terminals are great. Uh, <laughs> did you all see how my turret blew up an entire Ket gunship? I mean, yes, I'm pretty sure you saw it because apparently the explosion damaged the optic nerves of some males who weren't wearing the safety goggles. Males, the goggles are your friends. Trust the goggles. The goggles do not sing. I'm off to Apex training, but I've left the codes, and you can contact me for help if they're killing everything too fast, and making the rest of you pijacks look bad. You're all the best crant a female could ask for. You're <laughs> Let's show the galaxy what we can do. Also, keep those IFFs up to date. I installed a behavior algorithm where the turret actually gets happy when it kills things. Like Blood Rage, but for a turret. And I'm pretty sure it works as intended, but you never know. Have fun! Would like to add... That even though I've got the little thing on my phone, you guys are still in charge of chat. Yeah. You know, I know. Okay. I didn't really see any way to respond to it. Okay. He just said. I mean, it's it's a comment. <laughs> New fathers. Any other males who have kids interested in getting? Any other males who have kids interested in getting together? Now that we're supposed to raise them along with the females instead of just visiting, I have a lot of questions. Let's get together with the little ones and figure out how to do this. And maybe let's keep it safe. No explosive rounds, all right? 
Contact poster for information on meetup times. Aww. They're trying to figure out how to be dads in a place where they don't have to constantly worry about teaching people how to stay alive. Or at least not as much as they did. Mm -hmm. All right. Then we gotta go find that that one again. I mean, that is the funny thing, because, you know, like, they tell us how horrible Elodin is several times. Mm -hmm. But everyone agrees that it's better than Tushanka. Right. Hey, boys. Can we? No? Okay. That's well, fine. At least they That's were, fine. like, polite about it. Like, okay. Oh, sorry, you're not allowed in here. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Right. And then... Yeah. Hey, Herc! It's Herc! God damn it. They're always so far away. Might as well. Alright, what is this a uh, mission for Drac or something? Yep. Okay. Yeah. When they were talking about safety, they specified no explosive rounds. So yeah. Then, you but, know. you know, regular ones are fine. Regular ones will probably be fine. It'll, it'll be fine. Ooh, a falcon. I kind of want to play with that. Okay, wait, what? No. What? Eh. 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 No. What the? No, I... D oh, my <laughs> God. Just unequip, okay? Just... It really wants you to take that Valkyrie. No, son of a bitch! <laughs> <sighs> Sorry, honey. It's so not intuitive. Giant mites. Yeah, we've shot a ton of those. Now I have an unmodified one. Yay! Thanks, Silver. Oh yeah, stealth doesn't this exist in this game. Reminds me of a beat back home. I thought I saw a boil on the butt of pirate them. Yeah, that sounds about right. They don't even have a lookout on the back door. Most people wouldn't complain. Be nice to have some kind of challenge. It's the least they could do making us come all the way out here to kick their sorry asses. Over there. Guessing that's the colony's transport. Yeah, that's it. The sea vault better still be on board. And if it's not? I tear this place and everyone in it apart until we find it. So, what's a sea vault? So, um, the sea vault is uh, just that it's a collection of the seeds that they brought with them from the Milky Way. Oh, they need that. Yes. Um, this is like, oh, there we are. it's also... Like important nutritional things for growing Krogans. Yeah, for Krogans oh. specifically, because they have nutritional needs of other stuff. So, like this would this would seriously impact their ability to uh, repopulate and to main and to remain independent. Right. Ah, there we go. Is that a grenade? Did you shoot a grenade? How oh, dare you, sir! I would not doubt that. Feels like I'll die of boredom. Well, that disciple. That would have been bad. Maybe I should have put that. Data pad. Current security systems. Medium. Issue. Abel Bryant. Moonyard Super. 
Marlon, strike team successful. Stole a large transport from the Krogan colony on Aladdin. Huge thing, just like Boss said. Contents include weapons and seeds. Currently docked on Moonyard B. Boss is on site to see what's salvageable. While the transport is docked, security status remains at medium. The Krogan may want it back. Yeah, they do. We're coming to get it, yo. Is there anything even up here? Or is this other? Oops. I was too fast. Arone, we got a problem. Oh, it's a roan. Who's that? Get oh. it together. Stop them. A roan um was the he was Spender's contact. Wait, did I hear a roan? Yep. Spender is involved? Can it explain how they got the codes to the transport? Aron, we're gonna have a friendly little Who's Spender? He's the dick on the Nexus that works underneath, um, what's her name? Addison. Addison, yes. Oh. So Spender is the one who, um, <laughs> negotiated with the Krogan to get the Krogan to kick the exiles off of um. the Nexus and then went, no, I didn't agree to any of that. I don't know what they're talking about. Spender did that? Yeah. And we... Yeah. That was one thing we did last time, I think. We tried to... Yeah, we tried to take him. care of Spender, yeah. Like, we went into his private quarters and found he had a bunch of stuff he shouldn't have. But we weren't... Uh, I think we found something that was, like, monitoring we found communications. A and we found a scrambler. Yeah. We found a scrambler, and we found an area of the room that was a dead zone, basically, that we couldn't couldn't monitor it at all. So we took the scrambler to a tech guy, and he said, come back later. Yeah, the tech guy was like, why do you have this? Do you know like, how illegal this is? Why do you have it? And we're like, I'll tell you why we have it later. I need you to figure out what it did. Nice. Um, so, yeah, we can't actually nail him right now, but hopefully after this. We'll nail the crap out of him. Yeah. Oh, uh, speaking of stuff that people need to get nailed for, that, uh, <laughs> um, Gosh, the murder on the Nexus that happened before we woke up. Yes. The person Which one? Uh, no, the, the, the first chick. murder on the, ne on the oh. Nexus. The person who was like... Oh, you mean Jim Garson? Yeah. What happened with that? Nothing? Nothing. We haven't finished that yet. Uh, nah. We... Hey! Nailed four, that's what she said. Thanks, Silver. The Krogan may want it back, you think? Says <laughs> Silver. Yeah. You have no idea what you're in for. They're getting better at this. Says you. Hey, what's that supposed to mean? I'm doing plenty good, thank you very much. Oh, hey. No, there wasn't a criticism of how you're doing. That was... They're getting better. Oh. No, they're not. Oh, they're getting better. Yeah. Sorry. I assume quads are nuts. Yes. Okay. They're Krogan. called quads because Krogans have four of them. Yeah. Ah. yeah. Krogans have uh, more redundancy than most of them. I thought so yes. they have redundant everything, so I assume that but testicles yeah. are included. Yeah, no. Krogans have a quad instead of a pair. I see. So... Yeah, so okay. they don't say grow yourself a pair, they say grow yourself a quad. Huh. This was a useless room. I think my turret just murdered everybody, too. Good job, turret. This is... No, this is a different one. Anything? Anything? No? Alright. Alrighty. Alrighty. Yep. Anybody else want to die? Just our own, I guess. We're Over dishing there. out death. I see a path on the other side. Maybe if we move this, we can get through. Lift rubble. <laughs> oh, we have a Krogan. We can't just, like, step into that giant crack to the left of us? Oh, because we all have to get through. We could. It was really wild. 
There was, like, no weight in that animation. <laughs> yeah. I mean, Krogans are strong, but... Come that was on now. really heavy. It should have... Let's just turn into a rescue mission. It does to happen in this. Uh, they're powering of up the ship. Of course, they're warming up for liftoff. Uh, we don't have time for this. Guess they figured out why we're here. We can't let them get away. without a hold on that transport. Yeah. 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 Transport or Vorn? We've got to make a move here. Fuck decision. Oh, what? Or not. Stay calm, we've got this. Yeah. You know what the colony needs. Just point us in the right direction and we'll get things done. We need to see Paul, but it's useless without the kid. What's with his other arm? Then we go get his him. arm clipped out. Oh boy. We're headed your way. So they're gonna get away with the seeds? I don't know. That's a problem. We have a better spaceship than them. That is presumably in orbit. <laughs> because cool guys don't look at explosions. Yeah. Oh. That doesn't look so steady. Got a boyfriend, apparently. Yeah. Eh, these things happen. Now we really have to save him. This <laughs> Kesh will be broken hearted if we don't. I was gonna say, Grandpa Grogan's worth a hundred times that. Yeah. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, Krogan Grandpa was not part of the Edge Ten. <laughs> Get over here so we can talk. I don't think so, Krogan. Stealing a transport was just step one. We're gonna destroy everything you care about. There's only one thing getting destroyed here today, and that's you, and this place, <laughs> and also your boss. And probably your entire crew. So a lot of things are getting destroyed here, actually. And all of them are yours! <laughs> <laughs> we find Born, then the transport, then I deal with a roll. I think my thing just killed everyone. Do, 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 do. Everyone's dead. Cause I'm an engineer. <laughs> We're going to go through this door. Hey, stairs. Oh, hi, guys. Oh, sorry. You just were so unimportant. Frederick? Actually, no, that was the drone that just pops up because I'm an engineer. 
Hi, Vorn. Why are you banging? Hi, guys. Uh, let's go. It's nice that we can pretend to help. <laughs> oh, no. Come on, that was a single shot. This is a Krogan. Better be, he's a Krogan. Come on, that was a pistol. You're welcome. <laughs> well, he makes a point. I mean, Drak gets shot at all the time. He's used to it. See, now he's acting like a Krogan. He just got right up and didn't care. <laughs> Thanks for reminding me. I need to get some stuff before we go. You talk to him. Both are good. Point? He's got a point. Okay. You do tend to get a little reckless in combat when things get personal. I won't let anything happen to my clan, Ryder. You won't be much good to them if you're dead. Quads, not you too. We don't have time for this. We have a transport to get. I'm ready to go. You, you stay right here. I'm not telling cats you died like they did. Just man your fruit stand, man. Yeah. A kid now, though, he just saved your life. Eh. You done yet? 40, oh, that's Kurt and Grandpa. Wow, he looked really weird. Yeah, he was on all fours or something. Kind of do. Wow, and you guys went out like bitches. Not gonna be much use to anyone in that condition. Oh, there it is. That is a broken Hydra. And later go up! Almost here. There's the transport! Lord, override the controls to keep the docking clamps shut! He was not supposed to be with us! Okay! We told him to stay behind! He what? chose not to. I think when he said you stay right here, he meant you stay right with us. Okay. That was a little... Never mind the bounty, just kill them all! Do 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 do. Yep. And turret! Hard to get a good shot in this range. Maybe for you. Turret's not having a problem. I'm not having a problem. I'm using an auto pistol. Whoa, dude, Liam! <laughs> Silver approves of Drax's speech. We kill them all. Probably that one. Maybe. Looks like we spoke too soon. Finally, something eh. I can sink my rounds into. Wow, they didn't die to one lightning bolt. Not that many pirates. We're all broken. There will be. Hello, Kydra suits. They don't look so good. Ah, uh, no, that's both of them. <laughs> that's a lot of explosions. 
Yeah. Everyone I pick up goodies. Is, uh, oh, damn it. I should That's not how you incentivize. Yeah. You should have said, you know, the bounty is name your bounty, just kill them. Right. I'll go ahead and also, thanks to the man who's piecing hands for the host. Thank you. Oh, thank oh is you. he doing that again? Awesome. Yep. It's very nice of him. Even though we're not supposed to be talking to him. <laughs> <laughs> There's a boy over here. Hello, boy. Oh, goodbye. Should we do an episode break here? Yeah, as soon as this thing's over. Okay. Well, I figured we should do it right before the thrilling conclusion. Nah. Yeah, that's okay. This, I can't remember if this ends dumb or not. Well, let's oh. find out. The man who speaks in hand says, wow. Uh, he may not be aware that we're playing on super easy, though. We we're are playing on story easy. mode, as opposed to any sort of challenging difficulty. Yeah. So, yeah, we're wiping the floor with everything. Uh-oh. Uh. Don't move. Shoot his shell? Is that supposed to work? You, uh, I'm taking this transport. This won't end well for you. <laughs> You're going to get yourself killed if you do this. Like I'm not dead the moment that crazy old Krogan gets his hands on me. Yeah, you're basically dead either way. This is just going to make it worse. I'm not the one you need to worry about right now. <laughs> Classic. Oh no, he had a durian with him! <laughs> wait, wait, don't come any closer. It'll affect anyone who isn't Krogan. It's pretty strong stuff. The man who speaks in hand says, <laughs> plebs. <laughs> so true. Did you just knock him out? Or is he dead? I, don't I know. think he's knocked out. I don't think that's going to matter. Oh, maybe it is sleep gas. Oh, yep, it's sleep gas. Morning! Speaking of classic. Mm -hmm. <gasps> you, you wouldn't dare! You're just bluffing! Yeah, we only... Oh. <laughs> just like we were bluffing when we killed all the other men? <laughs> Wait, no, no, don't let me go! Oh, well, thanks for dropping by. <laughs> See ya, man. <laughs> Uh, could he be useful? Who is this guy? Well, yeah, we're trying to... Um, we're trying to nail... We're right. trying to nail uh, right. Spender. Oh, so. yeah, we really need to nail so Spender. he might be useful. We need to know what Spender's up to. Besides, there's got to be a line somewhere. Figured you'd say that. Fine. Take him back to the Nexus. Area. Could you actually kill him? It's still not nearly yeah. as well. Oh, yeah, sure. Dropping him. I'll take your word for it. I'll tell you everything I know. Yeah, you will. Shut up, you quadless little shit. We're letting you live for now. <laughs> oh, you dumb motherfucker. Let's get this transport back to where it belongs. I'm gonna steal from the Krogan. That's smart. You think Spender would have been like, "Hey, the uh, the Pathfinder's looking into this. You might not want to be retarded." We are not having this conversation. <laughs> oh no! No harm in hearing him out. Back to do. <laughs> All right. And on that note, for those of you on Twitch, just kind of hang out for a bit. Oh wait, uh, it's still going. Damn it. Really. I actually thought it'd give us more of a pause. That's life on the frontier for you. You should have just let me kill a rogue. Would have been simpler, safer. We are totally murderers. We needed him alive. <laughs> so we need him alive. More useful alive than dead. Makes sense, I suppose. I can still kill him later. True. I can't wait to nail Spender to the wall. We'll get him too. We'll get him too. Sooner or later, we'll take him down, just like a rogue. Hopefully sooner. I have plans for him. Oh, listen to me, Ryder. You've been around me long enough to realize this. The fact is, I'm a relic, a symbol of the past. 
when Krogan were bent on destroying themselves. Fighting, killing, it's all I know. For my plan for Cash to have a real future, maybe it's best I'm not part of it. I have no idea what you're not alone is supposed to mean. I... Well, it's the heartfelt response, so... Mm -hmm. I don't think he'll appreciate it. It might. I don't know. This is. Do you're not alone? Okay. Your clan needs you, and so do I. We need to look out for each other. You say that now. Just remember who you're encouraging. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Trek loyalty is earned, and on that note. We love hey. you, Krogan Grandpa. Thank you so much for hanging out with us on Twitch. Just hang on a little bit longer. We're just taking a break. And for those of you on YouTube, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you guys next episode. Bye!